In the pantheon of metal, few frontmen are as unique and memorable as Pete Steele of Type O Negative. Towering over most at 6 feet 7 inches, with a deep, hypnotic voice that could traverse several octaves, Steele was a striking presence. But beyond his physical and musical traits, he held a rich tapestry of experiences that made him the artist he became. Today, we journey back to young Pete Steele's early life, piecing together the influences and events that led him to front the iconic gothic metal band. Pete Steele was born Petrus T. Retijic on January 4, 1962, in Brooklyn, New York, to a Roman Catholic family with Polish and Russian roots. The youngest of six children, Pete grew up in the Bensonhurst and Red Hook neighborhoods of Brooklyn, where the diverse cultural setting would lay the foundation for his eclectic influences. Steele's family and their strong Catholic faith played a substantial role in his formative years. His lyrical themes, especially in the early days of Type O Negative, frequently touched on religion, love, and death. This intimate link between religion and his art can be traced back to his childhood, where he grappled with beliefs, doubts, and the struggle of existential understanding. Steele's musical journey began not in metal, but in a more melodic space. Inspired by the likes of the Beatles, he first picked up the bass guitar and later the guitar. Before finding his place in the metal world, Steele was involved in several bands. Among the most notable was Fallout, a band he founded with childhood friends. Fallout offered Pete a platform to explore and hone his skills, laying down the foundation for what was to come. Before achieving fame with Type O Negative, Steele held various jobs, from park maintenance to driving trucks. Perhaps his most famous stint was as a New York City Parks Department worker, an experience he'd later fondly recall in interviews. These blue-collar roots would provide a counterbalance to the gothic, ethereal aesthetic of his music. Steele's prior band, Carnivore, was an early indication of his attraction to heavier, more aggressive soundscapes. However, it was with the formation of Type O Negative in 1989, alongside childhood friends, that Steele truly found his niche. Merging doom-laden riffs with romantic and gothic overtones, Type O Negative was born, with Steele's deep baritone and haunting lyrics at its heart. Pete Steele's early life, filled with the juxtaposition of faith, love, work, and music, shaped him into one of metal's most iconic figures. While his tragic passing in 2010 left a void in the music world, the legacy of Pete Steele and the indelible mark he left on gothic metal endures.